two-week Italy itinerary, exploring the heart of Italy, Italy is a country that effortlessly blends history, art, culture, and natural beauty into every corner. From the ancient ruins of Rome to the romantic canals of Venice and the rolling hills of Tuscany to the sun-drenched Amalfi Coast, Italy offers an unparalleled travel experience. This two-week itinerary is designed to give you a taste of Italy's diverse regions, each offering its own unique charm and attractions. Whether you're an art lover, history buff, foodie, or nature enthusiast, this journey will take you through some of the most iconic and enchanting destinations in Italy. But before we get started, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more awesome content, and ring that notification bell so you never miss a beat. Day 1. Arrival in Rome, morning, arrive in Rome. After checking into your hotel, take a leisurely walk around the city center to get acquainted with the area. Afternoon. Start with a visit to Piazza Navona, famous for its Baroque architecture and the Fountain of the Four Rivers. Continue to the Pantheon, an ancient Roman temple with an awe-inspiring dome. Evening. Toss a coin into the Trevi Fountain to ensure your return to Rome. Enjoy dinner at a local trattoria, Try dishes like cacio e pepe or carbonara. Day 2. Ancient Rome and the Vatican, morning. Begin your day at the Colosseum, exploring this iconic amphitheater where gladiators once fought. Nearby, visit the Roman Forum and Palatine Hill to get a sense of the ancient city's grandeur. Afternoon. Head to Vatican City. Start with the Vatican Museums and the Sistine Chapel to admire Michelangelo's masterpieces. Then visit St. Peter's Basilica, consider climbing to the dome for breathtaking views of the city. Evening. Walk around the Trastevere district, known for its vibrant nightlife and charming streets. Have dinner at a traditional Roman restaurant.
Day 3. Rome's Highlights, Morning. Visit the Spanish Steps and enjoy a leisurely breakfast at a nearby cafe. Walk to Villa Borghese for a visit to the Galleria Borghese, which houses an impressive collection of sculptures and paintings. Afternoon. Explore Campo de Fiori Market, a lively square where you can shop for fresh produce, flowers, and souvenirs. Walk to Castel Sant'Angelo for panoramic views of Rome. Evening. Enjoy a final Roman dinner and perhaps a nighttime stroll to see the city's landmarks illuminated. Day 4. Travel to Florence, morning. Take an early train to Florence, about 1.5 hours, afternoon. After checking into your hotel, start your exploration at the Piazza del Duomo. Visit the Cathedral of Santa Maria del Fiore, Florence Duomo, Giotto's Campanile, and the Baptistry of St. John. Don't miss Brunelleschi's Dome. You can climb it to enjoy an incredible view. Evening. Stroll through the Piazza della Signoria see the Palazzo Vecchio, and end your day at the Uffizi Gallery, consider reserving tickets in advance. Good morning. Visit the Academia Gallery to see Michelangelo's David. Explore the San Lorenzo Market afterward to do some shopping. Afternoon. Cross the Ponte Vecchio to the Altrarno District. Visit the Pitti Palace and the Boboli Gardens for a glimpse into the lives of Florence's elite during the Renaissance. Evening. Dine in the Altrarno District, known for its artisan workshops and authentic Tuscan cuisine. Day 6. Tuscany Day Trip, Option 1. Siena. Visit Siena, famous for its medieval brick buildings, the fan-shaped Piazza del Campo, and the Siena Cathedral. Option 2. San Gimignano. Explore San Gimignano, a small-walled medieval hill town known for its well-preserved towers. Option 3. Chianti Region. Spend the day in the Chianti Wine Region, visiting vineyards, sampling wines, and enjoying the Tuscan countryside. Evening, return to Florence for dinner. Try local specialties like Bistecca alla Fiorentina, Florentine steak, and Ribolita, Tuscan bread soup.
Day 7. Travel to Venice, morning. Take a train to Venice, about 2 hours, afternoon. After checking into your hotel, take a gondola ride through Venice's canals, starting at Piazza San Marco. Visit St. Mark's Basilica and the Campanile for panoramic views of the city. Evening. Wander through the Rialto Bridge area and visit the Rialto Market. Enjoy a seafood dinner at a local restaurant. Morning. Visit the Doge's Palace and explore its grand rooms and the infamous Bridge of Sighs. Afternoon. Stroll through quieter neighborhoods like Dorsoduro and Canareggio. Visit the Peggy Guggenheim Collection or the Gallery dell'Accademia for art lovers. Evening. Enjoy a Venetian aperitif, such as a spritz or bellini, at a bar along the Grand Canal. Morning. Take a train to the Shinku Terra, about 3 hours, afternoon. Settle into your accommodation in one of the five villages, Monteroso al Mare, Vernazza, Cornelia, Manarola, or Rio Maggiore. Spend the day exploring the village you're staying in. Evening. Enjoy a seafood dinner by the sea. Try dishes like trafi al pesto or frito misto di mare. Morning. Hike the trails between the villages. The path from Vernazza to Cornelia offers stunning views. Afternoon. Relax on the beach in Monterosso or take a boat ride along the coast to see the villages from the sea. Evening. Enjoy dinner with a view of the sunset over the Mediterranean.
In the morning, take a train to Milan, about three hours, afternoon. Visit the Milan Cathedral, Duomo, and climb to the rooftop for panoramic views. Explore the Galleria Vittorio Emanuele II, an elegant 19th-century shopping arcade. Evening. Visit the Sforza Castle and walk through Parco Sempione. End the day with dinner at a local restaurant, sampling dishes like risotto alla Milanese or cotoletta alla Milanese. In the morning, take a train to Como, about one hour. From there, take a ferry to Bellagio or Verena, two picturesque towns on Lake Como. Afternoon, explore the towns, visit Villa Carlotta or Villa Balbianello, and enjoy the stunning lake views. Evening. Return to Milan and enjoy a leisurely evening, perhaps with a visit to a local cafe or wine bar. Option 1. Amalfi Coast. Morning. Travel to the Amalfi Coast, 4 to 5 hours by train and bus. Afternoon. Explore Positano, known for its colorful houses and steep streets. Take a boat tour or simply relax on the beach. Evening. Dine on fresh seafood and local specialties like limoncello in Positano or Amalfi. Option 2. Naples. In the morning, travel to Naples, one hour by train from Rome, afternoon. Visit Pompeii, the ancient city destroyed by Mount Vesuvius, and explore its remarkably preserved ruins. Evening. Explore Naples' historic center, visit Spacanapoli, and enjoy authentic Neapolitan pizza.
Amalfi Coast. Morning, visit Amalfi and Ravello, known for their beautiful villas and gardens. Afternoon, spend the day relaxing, swimming, or taking in the views along the coast. Evening, enjoy a final meal with views of the sea. Naples. Morning. Explore Castel dell'Ovo and the Naples National Archaeological Museum. Afternoon. Stroll along the Naples waterfront or take a day trip to Capri. Evening. Enjoy a farewell dinner with local cuisine. Morning. Travel back to Rome, if not already there. Use this day for last-minute shopping. As your Italian adventure comes to a close, you'll find that two weeks have given you just enough time to fall in love with this remarkable country. From the ancient wonders of Rome to the serene beauty of Lake Como, you've experienced the best of Italy's history, culture, and natural landscapes. Each city and region you visit has left its mark, with memories of breathtaking art, delicious cuisine, and stunning vistas. Italy is a country that invites you to return, explore deeper, and discover even more of its hidden treasures. Until your next visit, you'll carry the warmth, flavors, and beauty of Italy with you wherever you go. If you enjoyed this content, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and share it with your friends. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below, thanks so much for watching today's video.